Hi students, this is Alex here. The function f is in terms of x and y as well as in terms of u and v where x is e power u into sin v and y is e power u into cos v. And we have to prove this expression. As a first part, we are going to find dou f by dou u. This is nothing but dou f by dou x into dou x by dou u plus dou f by dou y into dou y by dou u. Now dou f by dou x written as it is, then partial derivative of x with respect to u, so v is constant, so sin v we will write as it is and after writing sin v, partial derivative with respect to u, so e power u derivative is e power u only plus dou f by dou y written as it is and partial derivative of y with respect to u. So cos v is constant. So let's write cos v and derivative of e power u is e power u. But finally we find that this term e power u into sin v itself x and the another term is y. So we will put x here plus dou f by dou y into y. So this is our dou f by dou u. Now we are going to write its second derivative that is dou square f by dou u square which is nothing but dou by dou u of dou f by dou u. Now we have two terms here dou by dou u and dou f by dou u. For dou by dou u without this f we have to write that is dou by dou u equal to dou by dou x into x plus dou by dou y into y. So here we get dou by dou x into x plus dou by dou y into y. And for the second term we have to copy along with f dou f by dou x into x plus dou f by dou y into y. Now we have to expand this. First term we have to multiply by another first term. So that will give us x square. Then dou square f by dou x square. Then this term with the second term will give us x y into dou square f by dou x dou y. Then third term will be the second term with the first term. So once again x y into dou square f by dou y dou x and the last term is y square into dou square f by dou y square. So let us keep this as a first expression. In the same way we are going to find dou f by dou b which is nothing but dou f by dou x into dou x by dou b plus dou f by dou y into dou y by dou b. Now dou f by dou x as it is. Now partial derivative of x with respect to b. It means u is constant. So we keep e power u as it is and derivative of sin b is cos b. So e power u into cos b plus dou f by dou y into partial derivative of y with respect to b. So partial derivative of y with respect to b again u is constant so e power u as it is and cos u will become minus sin u. Now we can replace the second term that is e power u into cos b as y e power u into cos b as y. This is y and plus dou f by dou y this is minus x because x is e power u into sin b but we have sorry this is b so we have negative term so we put minus x. Now this is dou f by dou y sorry dou v. 
Now we are going to find its second derivative that is dou square f by dou b square which is nothing but dou by dou b of dou f by dou b and we have two terms here for the first term dou by dou b without this f we are going to write the expression then for the second one we will write it completely with f so first term will become back it open dou by dou x into y plus dou by dou y into minus x similarly here dou f by dou x into y plus dou f by dou y into minus x now we are going to multiply this first term with first term will give y square into dou square f by dou x square then first term with second term minus x y dou square f by dou x dou y then minus x y dou square f by dou y dou x and the last term is plus x square into dou square f by dou y square let's take this as the second expression we are going to add first expression and second expression so now we have dou square f by dou u square plus dou square f by dou b square on the left hand side so dou square first expression is dou square f by dou u square second expression is dou square f by dou b square when we add the first term we get x square plus y square into dou square f by dou x square that is this term is added with this first term we are taking dou square f by dou x square common in the same way this last term will be added with this last term where once again x square plus y square is common so let's write x square plus y square common then the remaining term will be dou square f by dou y square so we have dou square f by dou y square now totally it is possible to take x square plus y square common and we get dou square f by dou x square plus dou square f by dou y square so we prove the first part of the question that is dou square f by dou u square plus dou square f by dou v square it is lhs we have it here dou square f by dou u square plus dou square f by dou v square and that is equal to x square plus y square here second order second derivative with respect to x and y so we have it here dou square f by dou x square plus dou square f by dou y square and there is also another part where it is given r and instead of x square plus y square we have e power 2 u from this if i take x square plus y square it will become e power e power u whole square is e power 2 u then sin square v plus e power 2 u into cos square v by taking e power 2 u common we get sin square v plus cos square v which is 1 so let's replace it here this x square is e power 2 u and first we have sin so sin square v plus e power 2u cos square v then the rest of the terms dou square f by dou x square plus dou square f by dou y square and here e power 2u and taken common this is sin square v plus cos square v which is 1 so 
we have the remaining terms as it is. So that gives the other part of the question. That is e power 2u then dou square of by dou x square dou square of by dou y square. So we got it here.